welcome back to Panator Plays MTG Arena. Okay, we're going back with Pat Cats, and it's, I don't know if it's going to be better, but we put in more buff cards. I also spent a rare to, to craft an adorned pouncer, because it gets much bigger, because Eternalize makes it a 4-4 thing. It also kind of fixes our early game a little bit, so we might be a little more consistent. I mean, I might have wanted to make it a Radiant Destiny or Vanquisher's Van uh, banner, but here we are. Don't know if it's going to work, but we're going to damn well try. Also, I have forecast thoughts and excellence thing. We have a lot of control. We have a lot of just like, let's let's get rid of that card for now. We don't want to deal with that card, which is sometimes the problem we have with with pat cats. Like, there's a big guy and we're just going to sit there and take it because the cat's too big and we can't deal with it. Wow, we didn't get it within five seconds. I guess 2.45 a.m. isn't good. No, p.m. pat. It's p.m. So everybody's probably asleep. So, this might not actually be a good time to try to come... Oh, we got one. So, we're probably going to end up playing against the same guy over and over again. So, hopefully, we just don't lose against the same guy over and over again. I mean, I'll take a 1-2. <laughs> That's not bad. Wow, this is somewhat terrible, but it's also not bad. We'll keep it. I actually don't remember if we go first or not. We're going to have, like, a high-pressure dude. So... Because we have the next few turns, we have a combat trick in Pouncing Cheetah. Maybe it'll cost him something. I do ever have the other cats, but this is fine. There's also another rare cat I want, the one that makes everything uncounterable. That's okay, too. Well, this is starting to look a little weird. There's also no combo, by the way, wherein we can play this so we can get free mana because mana disappears between phases, but that's okay. That's life. Also, this is probably going to die because it's black blue, so it's going to get countered or bounced. And we're in trouble. Well, at least we have a planes. So that's good. And first strike is... It, this is one cost? Excuse me? That's pretty good. Uh, yeah, that's our only target. Whee! And I have a friend. You want first strike? Because I have first strike. Meow, kitty cats. Let's roll. I guess if he... We can untap this and then get something to do next round. Get this going. Or we can play a regal, uh, a sacred cat. But blue has a, black has a lot of removal. So we might not want to do that. I'd rather trap it with a Ponzi Cheetah so we can uh, pressure him a little bit further. I don't know if that's the right call, but it's certainly the call we're making. Wow. It is enough for him to be concerned about that trick. Does this have a mic function? Am I telling people what I'm doing again without really meaning to? You're a dead cat. Sorry, Initiates Companion. You're a dead little kitty. That's absolutely fine. It's certainly weird right now. You know, mark this again. Just in case we want to play a dude. Combat. He's playing very conservatively, which concerns me somewhat. Uh, sure. Because if it dies, it doesn't matter to me. He really doesn't want me to untap nothing, by the way. So that's weird. That tells me he's got a really weak late game. If this dies, it's fine. I'll be back. Put one here and turn. Because we got a Pouncing Cheetah we might want to throw at him. Meow, meow, meow. Wow, we've got cats of all sizes. Also, there's this, there's this we have things that bounce permanence back to your hand, which kind of ruins my cartouche. Kartoki? I gotta, I gotta take a look at how that's actually pronounced. Yep, there goes Impale. That uh, lets that resolve. Yes, we'll let that resolve. I'm actually gonna play with a Pouncing Cheetah. It's just so we can keep applying pressure. And we get an Involving Wilds, but we also don't need that. I don't want to play with a Caracal just yet. First of all, we can't play with a Caracal. What? It didn't let me play my land. Or did I play a land? Honestly, I think I played a land, and I'm, I'm just like freaking out for no really apparent reason. Oh good, a Scarab God. Uh... Well, this is happening. Whee! Yes, let's get a forest. I mean, a plains. Have fun with that Scarab God. Can I target it? Uh, scry, delete stuff. Flash, dude. Ah. Uh, one, two, three, four. 
That's why we have four cast outs. Whammy! And communication. Maybe I should have played the Caracal. I would have applied more pressure. I think I should have recognized I was the beat down. He plays the second one, I'll drop the Caracal and like just go to town. You can destroy it, but I have 15 more and various variations of it. I am ready to remove Bib Clats. I am ready to let my kitty cat smash you in the face. That's still bad though. That's like, that's still like bad. Be Caracal now, I think. He's tapped out. He's not gonna, he, if he has a counter, he's not gonna use it right now. Yeah, just keep attacking. He can only block this dude. And if he does, the other guys will still keep going and we'll get lifelink. And then we might have lethal next turn. That's probably not true though. Did we disconnect? Is, is, is this the time of day to disconnect? Oh my god, we're gonna disconnect because we're winning. How dare you? Uh, there we go. Whee! Uh, I mean, we lose a 4 3, but we also bring him down, which is fine. Yeah, this will live. That's fine. Because then we have lethal next turn. I assume he's too slow to actually go to town on us. So just attack all, Pat. Just just keep going. Yeah, block the cheetah. Yeah, you gotta block the cheetah. So assuming he blocks the biggest dude, we'll still deal two. We'll still deal enough damage. If he plays one more dude, he'll block these two. And then we'll still deal five damage. That is, you know, in case we don't draw another cast out. Oh, baby. Also, this is now bad for him because he might kill himself or does. Does he gain life? No, he just loses life and scries. Oh, that's not great. My my kitties. Well, now we're in trouble. Now I need a second cast out and maybe more draw. Okay, we have a lot of outs. Don't worry about it. We've got a ton of outs. We've also got one exiled Caracal. Like, we get any of our buffs, we're good. Uh, that's it. You don't want to attack. For a second, I thought he played another one. He is looking hard. Oh, he's got a champion of wits. That's a problem. Hmm. Well, I can bring him down to one. No, wait. It's it's auto-tapping for me, which is actually fine. That's actually the mana I want for it. Gotta block one of them. Yes! Damage. Wait. There we go. So we can bring it back. Whee! And turn. Put stop here. Then we'll just drop this and punch him. I doubt he has... Like, if he kills this, like, I can pass and he dies. Like, if he, like, casts out. Oh, that's fine. Still down to one. Combat. Attackers. Block. Yes. Meow! We've done it. We've done it, little kitty cat. Oh, she's asleep. I haven't actually checked its crotch. That's probably for the best. Right now, I'm just happy it seems healthier. <gasps> oh, I actually really like this card. Oh, the game is pulling me in so many different directions. I don't know what to do with myself. Now we're just earning normal cats. I mean, packs. I've got cats in the brain. Look, I've won once. I'm happy. It's also likely we're going to fight the same dude over and over again. Because he's probably searching for a match too. I'm not sure if that's the same dude. Probably not. Lower rank. I mean, lower rank to the other guy. I don't even know what the ranks mean. Is higher better? Is lower better? Is this playable? Why, yes, it's actually kind of playable. Hey, are you a kitty cat man too? I see you're also a man of culture. I appreciate that. I'll disable him once. Full control. Oh, it's, oh fuck. <laughs> that's, that's a little bad for us. Big boys, big boys gonna give us problems. Uh, the Adored Pouncer isn't going to help if he does have something to play. So I'm going to play this dude because uh, 
He can kill Vadrover. That's it. That's it. That's uh, Oh, we're in trouble. But he is also stuck on free mana. Which is it bad or good for us? Could be horrible. Give me a land. Never hold two lands, but statistically we'll draw a land, because one out of every three cards is a land. Well, a little over one in three cards. Because we're at 24 lands, so we'll probably draw something. If I must cycle, I will. Is it white? Nah, it's just straight up red green. Ah, you're a man of culture still. Dinosaurs. Ah, oh, he has a radiant destiny. Oh, fuck. So, some good news here. Do we play the cat or do we try to roll for land? I think we try to roll for land, but we might need this for something bigger. For like an actual problem. Hmm. But we can't play it regardless. Tell you what, we'll play the pouncer. Uh, attack. He can't block. And tap this. And play the Sacred Kitty Cat. Why can't I play the second? Oh, shit. I was still in combat. Fuck. I was still in combat. And this needs, like, changes on the screen to, to figure it out. Hopefully that doesn't cost us too much. But Well, now it's going to cost us some. Because I have no way to deal with that thing. So this is going to get absolutely killed, which is uh, okay. Now we have to pray that we draw another card, because that's all we got. Uh, Bye, Pouncer. You're going to die to that thing, but I'm going to delete it. Hopefully we can delete it. Well, he's got his mana curve. Oh, we're done here. Oh, there is, there is no point in staying. We should not have kept the two land cards. So that's what we've learned today. Do not keep two land cards, uh, two land hands. It's a problem. Also, this is taunting me. Could you just disappear if you're not relevant? Or are you wondering, are you worried that the bottom of the screen will be notoriously empty? Empty space is fine. It draws the eye to a specific place, uh, to specific things. Uh, there are more than a few directors, I assume, that are totally into different guy, sure. I hope it's Matthew Mercer instead of Matthew Jerser or Matthew Jerker. He's going to jerk you off. Abandoned match. Wow, this may count as a loss. That has no consequence right now. And honestly, I kind of prefer that. What did we learn? Don't keep it. Don't keep it. Give me free lands. Give me free lands. Uh, shit. Shit. Ah, uh, we're about to scoop, just so you know. Kill me. <laughs> it's probably dinos. Is dinos the in thing now? That makes me feel bad for dinosaurs. Like, I need two lands off the top of my deck. Kill me. I need land. <laughs> Also, you yeah, have inherent card advantage. So we've got concerns. So, so that's a problem. That's good. That's good. We got a land. That we don't need right now. So that's gonna... We better pull a white. Um, that's gonna make it huge. Which is kind of okay. Man, that thing is a hard stop for us. Hmm. Oh, now he's got a big drover. Resolve. Combat. He can attack. I will actually block it. Block? My turn? Land? No, it's a... It's a little baby cat. Hmm. Uh, 
Let's attack with our Prowler. Weird. That was that was uncomfortable for me. That's why I went quiet. Like I expected something, not nothing. Also, this is gonna die to most of the effects that these guys can play, because they deal a lot of one damage stuff, especially if it's an enraged deck. Hey, you got your mana. Ah. I feel like every other card being a, a land is fine if we can make some of them to cycle lands. So I'm, I'm considering removing something. Maybe the Vizier. I mean, it's big, but it also one doesn't. It kind of synergizes. It, it takes the place of draw. Ah, uh, resolved. Let him hit us. Combat. Attackers. Go for it. No, just that. Yeah, that's fine. Take it. We had one good match, and then it was nightmares all the way down. Uh, my turn. Give me land. Oh my god, that could have been amazing here. We're getting choked out. It's not the end. But it's still bad. Every time we have to keep two land, the, the deck chokes. Uh, time to block a little bit. Time to suffer a little bit. Was it worth that one damage pad? No. I should have just blocked that thing. It still has trample though. Alright. That's fine. It doesn't have haste. I can remove it. And most of these guys don't run naturalize. I will block it. To draw into mana, I'll block it. I'll do everything I can. Then I'll remove that from... Ah, uh, resolve. Combat. Go for it. Can we pull out a victory? Statistics say no. How dare you? <laughs> okay. I mean... Don't have anything to play, and this guy's just toying with us at this point, so he can he can go have fun with somebody else. I'm going to play until I get... That's not true. I'm going to go take a look at our deck. We're going to remove something, possibly a, a rebirth dude, and then we're going to add a land. Uh, Cycle lands, you think? But they're too slow. Suggest me a land. Wow, you suggest only 59 lands. That's disconcerting. Do we need specific mana when we when we do that sort of thing? What the hell is this thing? Uh, not really. And we have four tranquil expanses. I think I'll just add a. What does early game look like? Mostly white cards. So another planes might be fine. Two games where we couldn't find a land means we have to adjust ourselves, and not just my crotch. We have to adjust ourselves mentally. Also, it's been red green all the way down. Are people? I don't like the interface they have. For instance, I think that's just a result of the game being what it is. But and that's why Hearthstone doesn't let you really interact on your opponent's turn because it's easier and it's it's not. It doesn't feel as janky. He also goes first, which is uh, which means he has tempo on his side. Bra Bard Bradian, Barbradian. Hmm. And if he has tempo, if he has tempo on his side, I mean, eventually I'll have to look at my cards game. I would like to play your video game. Now we're on the opposite side of the map. Uh. Well, one land isn't good. Oh my God! Sometimes this game. <laughs> oh, got a top deck the best. Fortunately, we drew into something. Extra land paying off. Maybe I should have kept the four land. I mean, I would have kept the second one, but it also had only had one land, so we were extra doomed. Blue, black. Ah, uh, this is control. So this is going to be fun, quote unquote. Yeah, I don't like the interface behind it because it's... One, it's over here. Like the resolve button should be really be, should really be a pop-up. Grant did something right and let you put away stuff. I, I actually don't like Ferro Prowler. I just don't have another... Nice two to drop. Well, this is nice. And in that we have mana to play now. And I'm just gonna keep hitting you with the one. 
We need more early game cats. That's my conclusion. Damage mount. Oh yeah. I mean, technically in a tournament, you probably, that is probably something you'd end up doing anyway. You have to keep asking like, is this, is a uh, uh, permission? Do you have any effects passed? Like it is that weird, but there's something about the interface that strikes me as very abrupt. Like the timings aren't quite right yet. Yeah, countering that is silly. I can bring it back. And turn. I mean, not that silly, but maybe we have to reserve our cast outs for bigger stuff. It's already saving it for a crackle or a, a big dude. Come on, kitty cats. You had a first going out. Don't be afraid of the big bad control deck. Uh, resolve. That's actually not going to do anything for us. He's looking for something. Ooh, he is short on shit. This is the time for us to play something big if we had a big 4 drop. Or even a nice 3 drop would do. I summon you, big lion dude. Oh, he did that at the end of his turn. Okay, that's fine. I wish turns were clear. I don't know why they're not so clear to me. Combat. Attackers. So he's got an effect. That's also a consequence of this game. And it's format. Hmm. It's scary, but still doable. Counter me. Waste your counters on my kitty cats. Wow, he did. Holy shit. He is viewing free as a threat. It does shorten the clock on him considerably, which is fine. Also, I can do this. And continue the pressure. Oh, we have different art woods. Oh, mommy cat. Who's a mommy little kitty? Oh, that's actually quite horrific. It looks like a paper mache gone wrong and they put a necklace on it. I think we just... Guess who's getting cast out? It's you. One, two, three... Poof. And I have an Angel of Sanctions waiting for him. I cast thee out, bastard. Now I'm happy I kept this motherfucker. This guy, this guy's gonna be great. If we draw land. What did you... I mean, this thing is really fucking good. Like, this thing is really good. Second one? Eh, I don't know if I have an answer to the second one unless we draw some land. I'm not sure we're gonna draw land here, son. Just play conservatively. Just, just hold on. Yay, you draw two cards. Hooray. Now block one of my dudes. If he blocks this, I can bring it back. Do, 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 do. Take it back. I can't even exile my own thing. That's priority for the best. That will tempt me into doing some really silly shit. Oh my god, 23 minutes already have passed. It's so warm. Are you already a champion of words? Can you do well on Japardi? I think it's just keep attacking, right? What else do we do? We have a lot of tricks, but we can't necessarily play them right now. A cartouche on our little kitty cat would be perfect. A cartouche on this is nice. He also has two mana, so I'm just gonna cartouche. What do we want? This, so if he finds a way to kill it, it's okay. Because that one we can bomb. If you put it here, he kills it, that's gone forever. This guy, this guy's gonna be back. I put 25 land in you. All right, we mulligan down to five. <laughs> Holy shit. Give me a land and we'll make him give up. Block this or take, I don't like, I, it doesn't really matter to me. It all kind of matters to me. In that, I'll determine whether or not you have a board. It's a race now and you have two cards left. I'm gonna assume these are like super expensive murder cards, which is fine. Interesting. One, two, four, five, six, seven. That's the thing with magic. There's so many, not really situational stuff, but there's a lot of mechanics into it. There's a lot of mechanics playing in Ascend. Like uh, getting the city's blessing in your cars, you to have 10 stuff. Ha 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 ha. Ah, no duress for you. 
<laughs> I'm waiting for that last land and then we'll see. You'll all see. Do, 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 do. You have five untapped lands. I'm not playing shit. I also don't need to play shit. You have so much untapped land, just in case he does a trick. I mean, that thing's gonna come back, which is fine. I'm playing it. Look at all the land you have. You tap out, I'm getting sanctions whatever the fuck you play if it's dangerous to me. Any permanent? I need five of these. One to, to, to put on my forehead, and another to put in the... Oh, shit. Yay, I drew a card. Please be another cat. Nope, that's land. That does force us to play a threat. Hmm. That is a problem, though. Because he has a counter in hand. I'd rather he counter this than the other thing. Yeah, he's already hovering over it. But if he uses the counter, we're safe. He did not counter it, in fact. No, don't attack. He's saving it for the sanctions? I can target it with uh, with something, with like an enchant effect. Or he has a way to kill the Crackle. It is black-blue. Yeah, that becomes a 4-4. Four, four. Because it's Eternalize rather than Embalm. That I am going to sanction so we can start attacking. I know we only have one of these, but I can't keep sitting around waiting for him to develop a board. He tapped out. This is our opportunity to press forward. Interesting. If he tossed a scry, it means he has what he wants. It's a token too, so it'll just cease to exist. Yes. Uh, combat. Tick this. Attack. That only deals 8, which is still kind of scary. This has the same effect while letting us maintain our board. If he wipes our board, like, fuck. That's, that's the aggro life. Nothing beats the aggro life. Stabbing folks with our aggro. Now he also can't stop the angel of sanctions from attacking. Yeah, tokens when they're exiled don't come back. They just cease to exist, which is totally great. So even if he kills this, it's fine. We now have lethal on board, which is fantastic. Especially against a control deck. But now we have bounce effects, and if we have bounce effects, that's fine too. Vizier of many faces. So are you gonna delete this? You should... not the Crackle. I don't know, maybe Crackle's the right call. No, my baby cats. So now he can block two things, which will leave one, two, three damage to go through. This must block this. Well, that's good. At least I can look at the top card of my deck. You don't want this to resolve. Yeah, that's that's probably right. Hmm. Block this. Or you could also cross block, let the free go through. 
But if you let's take free go through, he dies. I think patience is the better part of valor here. Yeah, I think that's fine. I think we just hold until we get the opportunity to strike. Unless we mulliganed away... I think we mulliganed away our... Or is that another game? Uh, how much mana is that? Hmm, how many times? Does it tell me how many times? One, two, three, four, five. Sacrifice a non-land permanent. One... Four, five. Twelve is fine. I should have sacrificed a cat. Holy shit. Very happy I didn't attack Vin. Um. Tense. Whoever draws something good first wins. Nothing to pull out of our deck. We don't have any... If we can delete one of them, we're good. But he's holding open for a counter. That was his opportunity to do that. We had to top deck very well to, to fight the... Uh, to counter that shit. I do They didn't even have it and just dropping him? Like That might have been nice. There is no direct damage, generally speaking, for these guys. Ah, I resolved that. I think we can get him with the cat. Because he has to block these two, and then he'll take three. But these, this, this dies. Really depends on what else we draw, but I am going to play the cat. Try to apply pressure. Yeah, because he's tapped out. This is the time to try to make a play. Oh, he's looking at his cards. He has to discard a card. Thanks to pull from tomorrow. Oh, yeah, he can play a land. So that's not great. I don't know if there's a one-cost counter still, but I don't think there is. My god, he's down. Yeah, I resolve it. My goodness. He's got all the cards. He's got supreme card advantage. Attackers. This is really unclear. This actually means move on to the next step, not the current step. Which has confused the shit out of me. One, two, three. I have a cat for V. My turn. Ugh, okay. I'm actually getting tired of the game. I don't think he can 12, but it's a zero us from 12, though. Unless he's got another thing, another one. But in that case, I'm just gonna, like, kill my cast out. Yeah, he can bomb it, that's fine. Down to and turn. Because if he casts it again, that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, that's nine, and it's just seven, seven times. Oh my god, he gained one life. That's actually relevant. The fuck is this thing? I think we kill him. If he if he makes a sacrifice this, I think we kill him. Because it's too... Oh, it's not a zombie. Oh, that's not good. Oh, he's going to exile a thing. Oh, that's not great either. Oh, we were so close. Unless we literally draw like a... Like a sanctions or something. That's fine. So far. Yes, now we kill him if we do this because he has two zombies. Okay, this is important. What do we pull? Oh, dude, come on. This, of course. Uh, pay? Mana? So we have unblockable... Flying dude. 
then our kitty cats grow, and then we have more kitty cats, and then we go into combat, and then we attack, and then he doesn't have enough blockers, and then he's dead! Slain. Mythic shit this. You black blue bastard. Although, if I were honest with you, that's probably the deck I want to play. He's tapped out. He's got nothing. Unless this has lifelink. It does not. I guess. Yeah, it was actually a good game. I, I, I'm i sorry. I'm, I'm... Oof. That was actually a good game. Because it, it was... It was back and forth. I had to struggle. Oh, wow. That's terrible. You make me not want to play your game, uh, Wizards. Did we actually go through two games or three games? Grames. Ah, uh, sure. We have time for one more. Unless it's a bad one. In which case, I guess the game's telling us to stop playing. Pet. Oh, my God. Two games, mana screwed. At least the ones when we did get our mana. Didn't we just play this guy? I remember commenting about his name. Oh, shit. Pride Sovereign, you've been absent, man. You wanna... You wanna get down, get down tonight? And party with the rest of us? What is it? Late? Nah. Meow. Rough night. Meow. That's that's the joke. I, I screwed up the order of the joke. So, there's that. I'm just gonna pour myself a cup of water. And by cup, I mean glass. And by glass, I mean cup. And by glass... I mean glass. Shit, you know what? We've done the reverse. It's time to try this on for size, which is bad. We get a cat. That annoyed the shit out of... I don't know who... I, I just played you, I think. Uh, we'll keep the cheetah. Is that a new thing? If you mulligan, you get to scry? I don't remember that being a thing way back when. Or if it was, it is one of the many, many things I just never paid attention to. Also, we go first, which means we start off the tempo. Now, you blue black, because you're going to need to fight hard. Also, we're going to miss our two. I should have chucked it. But I'd rather have a free, a surprise free, than a two. I love the idea of Flash, though. I believe it would... No, Teferi is phasing. I think this is the guy. This is the same guy we just played. Yeah. That had four clicks in it. I needed to click four times to start a fight. That is... This interface needs work, but that is in keeping with all the necessary steps of the game. So I don't think that's ever going to change. It's a little fiddly. I wish there were an easier way to work around it. We did try with some of the auto decision making. Oh, you tapped out. So I'm probably going to drop the cheetah. Oh no, my cast out. Um... I may as well cycle it, because it's going to get discarded. You might get something. Haha! -ha! Instead, you get nothing! It was going to get discarded anyway by Dodas. One of my favorite fucking cards. Well, at least we keep our cheetah. And since he's tapped out, we play this on our turn instead of his turn to develop a threat. <coughs> Whammy! Take that one damage! You know, I've been clawed at by a kitten repeatedly. And that is not one damage. <laughs> that thing stings like a like a motherfucker. So he's keeping mana open now, which is probably good for him. I can threaten with a... This isn't a threat, really. It's just more board position. I'm going to force out a counter or not. He probably shouldn't counter it. But the clock gets increased to four turns rather than its current... Yeah, he needs to... The, the clock on him is pretty intense at that point. So now the clock is at five turns. It would have been reduced to four turns, which is why he countered it. Oh, not playing this. Um, as much as I want to play that right now, he's got four land open and almost certainly another counter. I'm just gonna mark it here, and we don't need to pressure him that much. We need to understand. So when we draw, we put up a fight. So in theory, the deck is getting better. That's fantastic. Resolve. We don't have lethal, but it's going to hurt him. And yeah, we must have draw, but that's okay. Combat. Attackers. Block phase, please. 
Nope. Give me the kitty cats. Trickery is afoot! My turn. Then we can drop the vanquishers. Oh, I want to play you, but we can play you later. This is far more important to resolve right now. Cat. Well, one's gonna be hard. Cats! Cats! Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, you can subscribe to your Dark Five Cloud channel so you don't miss a thing. While waiting for the next episode, you can. Indestructible? Like the video, you can share it, you can leave a comment, you can do all those next things more, but you don't have to do anything. I say, not a boss of you. I am a spanator now. See you later. Very chit. How do I end the video?